hey guys I thought I would pop on here super quick and talk about the mascara combo I've been using I have no mascara on right now I have been using this Lancome uh, Seals Booster XL and then the Jordana Best Lash Extreme which is a super cheap three dollar mascara um, and this lash primer I have really been enjoying so I figured I would just show you how they apply and talk about it as we go here Let's set this down and while I'm thinking of it um on my eyes I'm wearing this little Lorac Pro like pocket pro palette it has uh, nude pewter and espresso and just a super simple quick little eye look and this um, is what the primer looks like and I'm gonna have to look at well let me pull this little mirror out of this little palette and make it easier hopefully you can see this is the first lash primer that I have tried that I really feel like it it does something I mean you can just see that the lashes are fuller and thicker and more multiplied when using this I've heard a lot of people say good things about this lash primer and I totally get it I haven't tried many lash primers but I've tried the Dior one and um, I think I've tried a Clinique one and this is definitely worth using you know any of the other ones I've tried have been just they felt like an unnecessary extra step but this oh yeah and the Estee Lauder little black primer I tried that too and I didn't like it it was extremely hard to remove I mean I'd say that stuff is waterproof I don't know it for sure but it was so hard to get off that it just wasn't worth fooling with okay and then here is the Jordana best lash extreme and what I've been doing it it's kind of wet I've only been using this for the past I don't know couple weeks and it's still fairly wet so I kind of wipe the wand off on a paper towel a little bit just to kind of get any of the excess off um I don't know I'm just not the biggest fan of wet mascaras so this is what the wand looks like it's just a really basic straight wand <clears throat> let's go in with this stuff and see how she rolls I mean I've already starting to get it on my eyelid there I don't know I, I cannot keep from getting this mascara on me I think it's good you know I haven't had any uh, smudging or smearing or flaking or anything like that but I just really think it's it's basic you know it's good it's a good basic cheap mascara so if you need a good um, good cheap mascara this is definitely one to try it is a little bit wetter it's not a super wet formula but it, it's wetter than I prefer but usually that means you could use this for the full uh, three months because I only try to use mascaras for three months but I think it does it does a really good job I mean it's easy I do you know tend to make a mess with it but there's a lot of mascaras that I make a mess with because, I don't know, I guess I'm just messy like that. It does tend to kind of get a tad clumpy if I'm not real careful and there's a couple spots like that one that always seems to get clumpy. So I use one of these uh, lash and brow brushes and just kind of separate the lashes a little bit. But I don't think you could find a better mascara for the price. You know what I mean? I, it is really good for the price. But 
for me, it's not, it, I don't know. I don't know that I would repurchase it. Uh, not anytime soon. But if I was on a tight budget, I definitely would. Because who wants to even go to the drugstore and spend $10 on a mascara? You know, that's, you know, whenever you could use this one for $3. If you're on a tight budget. And it's, and you know it's going to be, it's going to be worth using. Whereas a lot of the, uh, like, ones you can find at dollar stores and stuff, I've never found one that was worth using, you know even at the super cheap price, but I mean, I, I, I cannot complain. I, I can't complain about this. I have used it on its own, and while I can get this same effect in two coats, you know, but I really like that lash primer, the Lancome Seals Booster. I feel like it, it just makes everything better, and you don't have to use as much mascara, and I don't know. I've been enjoying this combination, this mascara is, it's okay and it's worth using, but I probably will go ahead and move along and try some other mascaras that I own since I own so many. But this is definitely worth using and it's <laughs> definitely worth the price that it costs. There's nothing bad to say about it. But let me know what you think. I love you guys. I appreciate you and I'll see you real soon. Bye.